Elementary school principal wants to trade in her students for some constituents. Amber Baker is running in the Democratic primary for North Carolina's 72nd State House District, which represents, as you see here on your screen, much of the city of Winston-Salem. Our Bill O'Neill joins us now with the story in our, in our continuing Commitment 2020 coverage. Ms. Baker says she learned a lot about the needs of the community while working as principal at Kimberly Park Elementary School for the past 12 years. The decision to run for office is out an extension of that work that I've already been doing in the community. Amber Baker says that all of her students qualify for free or reduced lunch and that many of their parents work more than one job, a kind of on the job training for a would be legislator. What is it that's at the top of your list that you would like to achieve down there? So, of course, at the very top is education and looking at how we can begin to work collaboratively to increase funding for teacher pay and class size. Baker says North Carolina needs to get creative when it comes to finding money for its schools. So we've only looked to the legislature to increase funding for schooling or to increase housing or to create workforce uh, development opportunities. But we need to begin to partner with our business partners. After all, we offer them huge tax credits to be able to move their businesses here. So now let's begin to create opportunities for them to become fiscal and financial partners with us in, in the, the public arena. Besides money, this educator says she wants to make a change in the curriculum. An African American history uh, requirement for high school students, but because of the regulations from Raleigh, it hinders them being able to add another required class. So I feel like Raleigh should not be regulating to that level. How do you like your chances in this race? Well, if I don't bet on me, if I don't believe in me, um, then there's no reason for me to waste the, you know, the voters' time about running. And so um, I'm just going to run the best race I can. I've already been doing the work. And so I am going back to the people that I have already been working for as a champion for their causes in this community and saying, look, if you send me to Raleigh, I'm going to continue this fight. We asked Baker about the lack of black candidates running for president in light of Cory Booker and Kamala Harris dropping out of the race. It does disappoint me because I think um, as, a, as a society, we are, we are so diverse and there are a plethora of people who bring different voices to the table. And when you just have a monolithic voice at the table, we really sell ourselves short. Baker will face LaShawn Huntley in the Democratic primary. They are trying to replace Derwin Montgomery, who is now running for Congress. In Winston-Salem, I'm Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News. And we have candidate profiles from a number of other races here, both in the state and as well as across the country for federal government. You can hear where candidates stand on a number of the big issues right now by heading to our website, WXII12.com.